Hey guys, this is Techno Genuine, and today's tutorial is to show you how to fix the this problem right here. Let me just uh, <coughs> zoom in here. So this is my phone, a six edge, and as you can see here, like I'm facing this problem, uh, the boot looping. In other words, the phone reboots itself uh, constantly, and it shows this message. And it's, it says that recovery is not C Android enforcing. And sometimes it shows uh, kernel is not C Android enforcing. And I've tried several routes, uh, kernels, I even tried with uh, Turip, but none of it uh, solved the problem. However, I found a solution. So I'll be showing it to you guys right now. Before I get into the process, first you need to have the following requirements. So first you need to have ODN 3 and it's preferred to have a latest version so that it can support uh, your phone. <coughs> uh, other thing is you need to have a USB cable and the last is to have a sock ROM that matches your uh, PDA or baseband number as well as the model number. If you don't know where to get the ODEN or the SOC ROM, then the link is going to be on the description below just in case. <coughs> Without further ado, let's move on to the processing stage. Connect your phone to your computer using a USB cable. Then on your phone, turn it into download mode as shown in this picture. And I'm sure that you guys know. If you don't know how to turn it into download mode, then Search it up on YouTube or you can ask me on the description below. I mean on the comment section, wherever. <coughs> now go to your computer and you should have the sock ROM and the Odin. Open the Odin and launch the app. <coughs> now here, this box here or here, I think it's here. The box should be highlighted in blue. After that, uh, click on AP and then uh, click on the SOC ROM. I already did this, uh, what do you call, I already uh, flashed my phone so I don't have to do it again. After, anyways, after that you click on start and you have to wait for 3 to 5 minutes depending on your phone's uh, type or what uh, yeah whatever and then you should be able to see your phone booting up properly and and that your data is not deleted thank you guys I hope you enjoyed the video please subscribe and like if you want to see more useful videos